Interesting comment coming out from Barry Bannon. Really interesting to hear it. So he's going to be interested in how you react to this one. Hello and welcome to the video. I hope you're all doing well. It is game day and we are looking forward to just getting on with the game and hopefully getting all three points. Yeah, that's going to be, yeah, let's not go into it. Well, anyway, let's talk about the uh, situation we've got here then. So, uh, as Barry Bannon had penned his usual column for the club, he talked about Danny Riddle and how he made a massive impact already. Uh, and despite registering just one win upon the upturn for the stats across the board, proved, proved hope for a busy Christmas period and a second half of the season. Explaining uh, how the lads were adapting to new ways at Middlewood Road, uh, Bannon writes in this own club website, the club will never wave any flag, we know that more than most after what we achieved last season. If we're being written off now, that's not right. I kind of get it. I understand it. He's got to do that rally, rally cry. But as a fan point of view, you look at it and see where it's coming from. But he's captain. He's got to say these things. Uh, we've got a top manager involved now. It's difficult to describe it. But I would say he's probably the best manager I have had in my whole career. We need to trust in him to get us out of this because I think he did a, he's destined for the top. Uh, I sometimes found myself in team meetings thinking, wow, kind of things, or how has he seen that? He has shown me things on the tactic board and in meetings and in games, and I have never seen any manager do. It's all about having this different approach. It's all about having a different approach to how we go about things. And I said this recently, look at how much tech we've got now, the drones, the iPads, looking at every little detail. It's a manager that's very stat-driven, but he, I guess he's a manager who looks at the tiniest details and goes, this is what we've got to look at here. Uh, he goes on to say, we have the right man in charge and it's about just sticking with him. I've got no doubt that the club will see better days soon. And this is the thing. If Barry Bannon's already seen that. And he's heard a couple of players say the things that we're seeing at a minute is very interesting. I, I say you've got to back him. This is, I know people are going to go with the manager, the manager and the captain going to say this. But I think Barry Bannon is seeing things that can improve. You're looking at stats. Granted, I know what's going to get said here, and I understand it. And where's my Twitter voice? Um... Oh, that don't win your points, but uh, winning games do, and they get you all the points and stuff. We need the three points on the pitch, not stats and data. I get that. I understand that. But at the same time, if the stats are going up, it means it's eventually going to come good. The thing here, can we have a good second half of the season? We will see. Can we uh, be able to recruit well in January? Barry Bannon is in... Uh, Barry Bannon. Chan Siri is in the UK to start discussing things like that. Hopefully that gets done sooner than later. We can have targets ready for January. You, you don't know. That's the thing. We don't know at all. We have to, have to, have to just try and hope that they can do something and just have a good second half of the season and just try and play catch up and hope for the best. I reckon if we can do that, then brilliant. But it's going to be a interesting end to the season. But Barry Bannon saying he's the best manager he's worked with is interesting to hear. I think you hope to see that comes out more in training and hopefully he's right and things start to turn a corner soon. 